Hi everybody! Welcome to the September Enjoy Box devotional and unboxing. So today we're going to go over the September devotion and then we'll unbox the September Enjoy Box full-size box for ladies. So the verse for this month was Philippians 2, 14 through 15. Do everything without complaining or arguing so that you may become blameless and pure, children of God without fault in a crooked and depraved generation in which you shine like stars in the universe. So I don't know if you've ever had the opportunity to tour a cave, but whenever I think of as Christians shining like um, stars or shining bright in this world, I always think of touring a cave. And whenever you go into the cave, they'll take you in to the farthest part of the cave that you're allowed to go into in the deepest, darkest part of that cave. And then they like to turn out all of the lights and it's completely pitch dark. You can't see the hand in front of your face. It's so dark. Um, and they actually say that if you were in that environment for too long, you would go blind because it is that dark. And then they'll let you, they'll talk about, um, talk about those things while the lights are turned off. And then they like to light a candle so that you can see what it was like for the very first explorers of that, of the cave, um, and how little light they had to go on off of to explore the cave. And um, as soon as they light that candle, it just pierces right through the darkness. And um, it's just really neat to see how quickly, as soon as that light turns on, that darkness just goes away. And all of your focus is on that light. Um, if you were to go, into, go to a cave and turn on your flashlight outside the cave before you get into it, no one would notice your flashlight. And then as you got progressively further into the cave, the flashlight would seem like it was getting brighter. I mean, when you first entered the cave, it's still probably no one would really notice it. But as you got a little bit further and a little bit further and deeper into the cave, then people would definitely start to notice that light coming from your flashlight. Um, so the darker it gets, it appears that the light's getting even brighter. I think that's such a good illustration of how it should be for us as Christians, that we should shine as this even brighter as this world gets darker, that we should be shining brighter. We should stand out in this world. People should look at us and see that we're different and different in a good way. And they should wonder what it is that sets us apart, that makes us different. Why do we have hope? when everything seems so hopeless? Why do we have joy when there's really not a lot to be joyful for maybe in a certain circumstance? Um, and you know, the one part of this verse that I definitely don't wanna skip over is the beginning part that says, do everything without complaining or arguing so that you may become blameless and pure children of God without fault in a crooked and depraved generation. I mean, it's so easy to get caught up in this world and to um, get upset by the things that happen in this world and to start to complain and to argue over things that honestly just don't mean anything. But that's one of the ways that we can definitely stand out is by not getting caught up you know, in a silly argument, not going on social media and venting all over the place. Um, we don't always have to give our opinion. Sometimes it's best just to be quiet and for people to see that there's something different about us. And so I just encourage you to, this week, really think about that, really think about how you can shine, how people, um, when they look at you, are they seen? A difference? Are they seeing that you're shining or did they see just the same as everyone else fitting into the world um, and no difference? So be an encouragement to other people. Be a light to other people because there are a lot of really hurting people right now. Um, there's a lot of hurt in this world and
They need to see our light. They need to see us shine. They need to understand that the hope that we have that lives inside of us um, is Jesus. And at the end of the day, that's what it's all about is making him famous and pointing people to him. So let's pray and then we'll unbox the September box. Lord, I just thank you um, for this reminder, Lord, that we were called to shine the way that you shine. And as this world gets darker, Lord, I just pray that you will um, encourage us to be the light, Lord, and to be an example of, of you to others. And that when people see us, that they'll just wonder what it is that's different, that they'll ask us. And Lord, that we'll point them towards you and the hope that's found in you. And I just thank you for who you are and your love for us. And thank you for each person watching today. And I pray that they'll be encouraged. And in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So the September Enjoy Box. This is the full-size ladies box. And every box comes with either a magnet or a sticker, which you can peel off. And handwritten card. Of course, every box comes with a handwritten card specifically for that individual. And while that card is being written, that individual is prayed for. And um, they are specific for that person and just kind of depending on however the Holy Spirit leads to write for that person. Okay, and then the verse card, do everything without grumbling or arguing so that you may become blameless and pure children of God without fault in a warped and crooked generation. Then you will shine among them like stars in the sky. Philippians 2, 14 through 15. And then on the back, just letting you know that our October boxes are available for pre-order. If you're a subscriber, you'll definitely get that box. Um, if you just bought a one-time box or received uh, it at Enjoy Box as a one-time gift, then and you'd like to get the October box, then definitely go up and, and uh, go ahead and pre-order that. So the personalized item this month is a drawstring bag, drawstring backpack bag, and then it has cute little fireflies and says, let your light shine, and then has the personalized name on it. And I love these bags for like my kids' sporting events, um, or if we're going to go maybe have a picnic or go on a hike. These are just really handy and easier a lot of times to carry than a regular bag. So um, I just love these. They're easy to clean too, just kind of to wipe off. So hope you enjoyed that. And, and every box has this little mini lantern. And I'm gonna take it out so you can see how cute it is. included with it. You like the tea light and then it's glass around here. And that goes on and then this little holder just clips in there. So it's just a really cute mini lantern. It makes a great decor piece for around your house. Um, it just hangs somewhere and, and light up. That's super cute. And the next thing are the Lumen Essence Copper Wire Mini Lights. And they're just little mini lights. Um, they're 17 feet long. So they're longer than a lot of these lights that you find. And I just love these. And we've sent these in a box before and our subscribers really loved them. So we wanted to send them again. So honestly, there's so much that you can do with these lights that even if you got them before, having some more is definitely a good thing. But these lights are great for Lots of different decor around your house. You can wrap them around wreaths, wreaths or you can put them even inside uh, like this little lantern or if you have a larger lantern, 
put, putting them inside for that is great. And then these are, I believe, yeah, USB or battery powered, which is really cool too. So we love that. And for the food item this month, we did Sweet Caroline Confections Sucker. And the sucker is just so pretty. It has uh, little stars in it and it looks like a night sky with the stars shining. Just a really pretty, yummy treat. Next thing is a bracelet with stars. And again, this is just to remind you of your verse this month of shining like stars in the universe. And so as you wear that, just be reminded of that, that you were made to shine. And the next thing is Then She Shines hair clip. And these look really cute uh, with your hair pulled back. They really, actually do a really great job at keeping your hair held back. And it looks really cute when it's in your hair. And it's just kind of a unique um, hair clip. So I hope you really enjoy that. And if you have shorter hair, hopefully you can pass it on to somebody who would really get some use out of it. And then the last thing is the Ultra Shine Lip Gloss. And again, just playing off of the shine theme, it's another item um, that's just kind of a fun reminder for you this month to shine. And also, lip gloss is always kind of nice to have. You don't want to mess with lipstick, or sometimes I like to put it on top of my lipstick also. Um, so that is it for the September box. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, I think it was a fun month. Lots of cute items. And um, so for the next month, which is October, the verse is John 16, 33. I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. In this world, you will have trouble, but take heart. I have overcome the world. And the Lord really just laid this verse on my heart for the month of October. Because it's just, there's just so many people that um, need to be reminded that what they're facing and the difficulty that they're facing should not take them by surprise. Uh, I mean, Jesus told us that we would have trouble in this world. We should expect to have trouble in this world. Um, but the thing is, we never face that alone and he has already overcome this world. So we can take heart, we can be of good courage because of that promise and because of that, the fact that he has already overcome all of this. And so I just think that it's going to be a really good encouraging month encouraging box and if you haven't signed up for it then go sign up for it and I think you'll love it and I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your September and great week. Thank you. Bye.